my class. So how are you today? I hope all of you are doing well and still passionate uh, about following our class program. Yes, I hope you're still excited to follow, to join and do our activities today. So before we start our day today, how about we sing a new song? Ah, that's a good idea. Yes, yeah, so we have our good morning song that's a new song. So you can follow Miss Kiki and Miss Free to do the action or movement okay. and the song. Okay kids, are you ready? Let's start in one, one two, two, three. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. One, two, one, two, three. Good morning. Good morning. Hello and how are you? Early in the morning, I say good morning. Hello and how are you? Good morning. Good morning. Hello and how are you? Early in the morning, I say good morning. Hello and how are you? In the morning.
now let's try again so you want to play with us also okay let's try again let's try again Okay kids, now let me start our subject lesson. Do you still remember what what did you learn last week? Yes, you, you are, are right. right. So, uh, yesterday, last week, you have learned about part of your house, mm -hmm. the rooms in your house, there are living room, dining, dining room, room, bedroom, bedroom Bathroom, bathroom and kitchen. kitchen. So this week we still learning about our house, mm -hmm. and today we gonna more specific to discuss or learn about the objects or things that you can see or you can find mm -hmm. in your kitchen. So as you can see mm -hmm. here in front of us, yes. we have some objects. That you can find in your kitchen. So let's start with this. Mm -hmm. oh, wow, do you know what is this? Yeah, yeah that is, is cup. cup. And I have this one. Hmm, what is this? Yes, yes. this is this bowl. And if you want to cook something, mm -hmm. you need this one. What is this? Pan. Good job, kids. And then I have this one. Um, this is sauce pan. And then if you want to cook the water, mm -hmm. you can use this. Do you know what is this, kid? Yes. This is kettle. kettle. Okay. And. What else, mystery? Mm -hmm. And then we also have a spoon. Yes. And then spatula. spatula. Knife for mm -hmm. cutting the fruit or food. Yes. And fork. fork. Yes. Mm -hmm. And also we have this one. Mm -hmm. What is this kid? Yes, yes, this is teapot. Okay, so kids, mm -hmm. maybe you can go to your kitchen, kitchen now to find any other object that you can see in your kitchen. Mm -hmm. But we have um, our vocabulary paper mm -hmm. here, so we have some pictures of the kitchen equipment mm -hmm. so we have this one mm, i know that you have this in your kitchen yes that is fridge and we have this microwave and we have this one fruit juicer and if you want to make a toast bread mm -hmm. you need this this one is toaster, toaster. And we have this one. What is this, Miss? What's bean? Oh, what's bean? Mm -hmm. And oh, if you want to cut mm -hmm. the fruit or meat or something, you need this cutting, cutting board. board. Okay, mm -hmm. so we have napkin here, we have sink, and then rolling pin, mm -hmm. mixer, mixer, oven. 
and many others in your kitchen maybe you can find by yourself and then mention it to your mommy or your daddy what did you find in your kitchen okay so happy learning kid mm -hmm. i hope you can enjoy this lesson mm -hmm. then you can learn and play with your parents, parents. at home Let's we continue to learn the letter from our jolly ponies. Yes. So this week we going to learn about a uh, new letters from Jolly Phonics book three. So there are letters G, O, U, L, F, and B. But today we only learn about letter G and make k k sound. sound. Yes. So remember the action like this, like pretending this is the water that going down and going down to the drain and make sound. K k k Alright kids, before we start, I want to read the story about letter G. So please, you pay attention and listen carefully about the story. Okay. Wow, this is a story about letter G. So, one day, there is a girl. She is Giselle. And she is visiting her granny's house. And then she goes to the kitchen and found that the sink, the granny sink, is blocked. Oh oh! And then she tells to her granny, and then the granny calls the plumber and asks to fix the sink. And after a while of repairing the sink, the plumber finally managed to fix the sink. And then uh, he unlocked the, the sink and the water goes down to the drain. And as it goes, it makes a gurgling sound like this. <laughs> <laughs> yes, finally the thing fixed now. So kids, maybe you can take a look here and find the object that starts with letter G makes sounds. Okay, let's try it. Hmm. This girl, girl, yes. Her name is Giselle. Wow, Giselle is start with the letter G. Yes, that's correct. And how about her hair, mystery? What color is this? The color is gold. And the founder, the color is brown. So gold is start with letter G. garden with uh, animals here. Do you know that garden is start with letter G? Yes. So gar G or G is for garden. And look at the garden. There, there are some animals. Oh, look at this. What picture is this? Gold. Gold is start with G. And pig. Pig. How about pig? That 
pick that with letter G? No, but pig has a letter G at the end. Pig, pig. Yes. And how about frog? It not start with letter G. No, but frog has letter G at the end. Frog, frog. Yes. And what else? What can you see here? Oh, this one. What is this kid? Yes, it is gloves. Gloves. So gloves start with letter G. And what else, kid? Or maybe you can find around your house. The, the the thing or object that starts with letter G. G. So here we have the letter G over there. Mm -hmm. This is the big or uppercase letter G, and that one is the small letter G or lowercase G. So before we continue, Jane, I want to invite you. To sing the letter G song, remember the action. Okay, do you still remember the song, kids? Yes, I hope you still remember so we can sing, sing together. together in one, two, three. The water goes down the stream. The water goes down the stream. The water goes down the stream. down and curve it at the bottom okay now how about we try to write the letter G on the board and we three will help you to write down the letter G on the board and for you kids maybe you can try to prepare the uh, paper and pencil to write the letter G on your paper so we start from top make a circle yes and now make a straight line down and curve it at the bottom okay one more time maybe you can make a dot, dot. yes this is also the parents can make like this for the kids one two three years old and then they will follow the dot line Okay, we start from, we follow the dot line, mm -hmm. we start from top, make a circle, yes, and now make a straight line down, and curve it at the bottom, like that. 
Yeah, what letter is this, kid? Yes, yes. this is letter, letter G. Make k k k sound. Yay! Yay! Good luck, kid. Happy to try. Okay, before we continue, let's we review the letter from Jolly Pony Book One. Yes. The letter S make sound. The letter A make ah ah sound. The letter T make sound. Letter I make i i sound. Letter P make p p sound. Letter N make n sound. Yes. That is the letter from Jolly Phonics Book 1. And here Miss Kiki has a letter from Jolly Phonics Book 2. So are you ready kids? Mm -hmm. I have this letter, mm -hmm. a special letter that has same sound. Mm -hmm. We start with letter C, makes k, k sound. sound. And letter K makes k, k sound. And I have this letter. Mm -hmm. This is letter E makes a, a, a sound. sound. And I have letter H makes <sighs> sound. And letter R makes er sound. sound. And letter M makes Mm sound and the last letter D makes t -t 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 sound. sound. Yes. So I hope you still remember all the letters that you have learned before. And we're going to continue to blend the letters and we combine the letters, some letters from your Phonics book one, book two, and book three. So, Miss 3 will help you to blend the letters and read some simple words. So, the word is start with the letter T, A, E, e and T. T. Okay. Let's we try to read. G, E, e T. G, E, T. At g at g at cat cat yes good job next start with the letter k k e Start with the letter K, K, A, A S, K, A, A, S, K, 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 A, S, Yes, good job. Maybe one more time. Mm -hmm. Maybe Miss Kiki want to try. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright kids, now let's take a look here and follow Miss Kiki. Repeat after me. K G E E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N K E N
can find at home to read a simple word uh, with the letter from your phone book one, one two and three. three yes happy to try well kids now it's time for jolly phonics activities so i have some worksheets here according to book one two, two and three. three and we have the worksheet the first worksheet that is match the picture to, to the, the correct sound so how to do these activities look mm -hmm. at this here can you see some letters at e and and here there are some pictures so we need to find the we need to match the correct the picture with the correct sound for example mm -hmm. this is letter s, s makes s sound and then we need to find the picture that start with the letter, letter sound s. okay so is for turtle, turtle? no, no. is for, for snake, snake? Yes. yes yes that is how to do this worksheet so are you ready kids maybe you can help us to answer okay now let's start mm -hmm. start with letter s. s we found the answer yes mm -hmm. maybe you can draw a line here miss mm -hmm. good and this is letter a, a make a ah, sound okay now we'll take a look at the picture is that for a ah, is for turtle, turtle? no a ah, is for snake no a ah, is for apple yes okay draw a line to the correct answer okay now next this is letter t make Sound. So T is for turtle. turtle. Yes, yes, that's correct. You have to remember the sound, kid, so you can uh, find the correct answer. Mm -hmm. Okay, now next, next, this is E E E. This letter I makes E, e sound. sound. So E for turtle. turtle. No. no E is for snake No is E is for apple No, no. Is E for igloo Yes, yes. That's correct We That's make correct. a line We draw a line mm -hmm. Okay now letter P, P Make P sound. sound Okay Start to, is that mm -hmm. P for turtle? turtle? No. Is that P for snake? No. no I don't think so. Mm -hmm. How about P is for apple? apple? No. no. Is that P for igloo? No. no. How about P for nose? No. Okay, the last picture. Is P for Pig. Yes, yes, that's correct. P for is for pig. Okay, the last one. Hmm, what letter is this? Yes, this is letter N. N make N sound. So I think that there is no picture. Mm -hmm. So N <coughs> is for nose. nose. Good job, Good kids. Job. Yay. Yay! So this worksheet for Jolly Phonics Book 1 is done. Now let's move to the other worksheet. So we can take it out here. Okay. So these letters are from Jolly Phonics Book 2. Okay, this is the same, the same worksheet uh, like before. Okay, we start with letter C. Make 
town. So is C for kite? No. Is C for rabbit? No. Is C for cat? Yes. That's correct. Okay. Now how about K? K is for Kite. Yes, that's good answer, kid. Okay, now next, this is letter E. Make a sound. Okay, let's find. Is A for kite? No. Is A for rabbit? No. Is A for cat? No. Is A for Mouse? No. It's a for egg. Egg. Yeah, yes. that's correct. We draw a line to the egg. The egg picture. Okay, now next. This is letter, letter H. Make sound. Okay, now let's find the picture. Mm -hmm. Is for rabbit? No. no. Is for cat? No. no. For mouse? No. no. For egg? egg? No. How about it for, for house. house? House. What do you think it? Yes, yes that's, that's correct. We draw line. Okay, now how about this letter? What letter is this? R. Yes, make R sound. Okay, now let's take a look on the picture. Mm -hmm. Is that for Kai? No. no. R, is, R is for oh, rabbit? rabbit? Yes. Can we draw a line? Okay. The last, the last one. one. So this is letter M. M. Make M sound. Okay. Is that M for cat? Is that M for mouse? Yes. yes. So M is for mouse. Good, Good job, job kids. kids. We still have another worksheet. Yes. Okay, let's take it all. Wow, this is the letter a mix or combined with the letter uh, with the Jolly Phonics book one, two, two and three. three. Okay, now let's start. This is letter. Do you still remember what letter is this? Yes, this is letter D. Make sound is for ant. No, is for Tiger? No. Is for talk? Talk? Yes! yes. You are right, kid. Right. Is for talk. talk. Okay, now next. Ah, this is the letter that we have learned today. today. So, you still remember what letter is this? Yes. yes. This is letter, letter G. G. Make k k sound. sound. Okay, now let's find the same sound. Mm -hmm. Is k for an? No. Is k for tiger? tiger. No. Is k for dog? I no. don't think so. Mm -hmm. How about k for monkey? monkey? No. Is k for goat? goat? Good. Yes, yes, that's right. We draw line. Okay. Now Next. let's continue with this letter. Mm -hmm. This is letter A. Make a a, a sound. And to my arm. A a a. And to my arm. A a a. And to my arm. A a a. They can sing me a line. So A is for ant. Mm -hmm. Do you see the ant here? 
Which one is that? This one? Yes. yes. So, A is for and. 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 Okay, how about this letter? This is letter T. Make T sound. So, let's find the picture. Mm -hmm. Is for and? No. no. Is for tiger? Tiger? Yes, <laughs> you are right, kids. Now we draw line to tiger. So t is for tiger. Okay, now we still have two more. Mm -hmm. This is letter I, I make e sound. Is that for dog? No. Mm -hmm. Is that for monkey? No. no. Is E for goat? No. Is E for ink? E yes. is for ink? Yes, that's correct. Okay, mm. the last one. This is letter M. Make M sound. Okay, now let's find the correct picture. Is M for goat? No. Is M for monkey? Monkey. Yes. So for monkey. monkey yeah Yay. well done kids you can try this watch it at home of course with your parents yes. help or you can do by yourself or maybe you can do with your brother sister. sister yes happy to try kids and happy learning Last activity. Mm -hmm. yes. We are on the art and craft activity. So what we gonna do, Miss Three? Okay, we will make a vocabulary book. Oh yes, we still do the same as before mm -hmm. with this our house vocabulary book. This is for four to six years old, and then. This blank paper is for one, two, three years old. So, but today we are going to stick the picture with the kitchen uh, equipment here. And then we need scissors for cutting. And please, kids, be careful to use this one, okay? And we you we need the glue, glue. and then of course we need the black paper, paper for this picture. Okay. Now let's start kit. Mm -hmm. We going to cut some picture. Mm -hmm. We going to do the first worksheet for one, two, three years old first. Oh, I want to remind you, you can find the picture uh, from the magazine or newspaper. You can find as much as you can. Okay, I have a plate here. Sticking on the paper, yes, and this is greater. And this is ladle. And this is four. And 
and we have spoon. Okay, that's all for the whole sheet. For the one, two, three. Oh, so maybe you can stick by yourself and ask your parents to cut the picture. Okay, now let's move to the vocabulary book. As you know that we going to stick the picture on the each page that has the first uh, that has the same letters at the first. Okay. Now let's start. Now what to use? Oh, this one. Okay, kids. Now I want to ask you. Can you please pay attention here? Do you know what is the first letter here? Yes, that is letter B. So we need to find the letter B on our vocabulary book. Okay, this is letter A. Ah, oh, this is letter B. So we need to stick on this page. So B is for gold. Yes. Okay. Next. Now take a look here, kids. Okay, so I got this picture. This is dishwasher. So can you uh, find the first letter? What is the first letter here? Yes, it is start with letter D. So we need to find letter D on the vocabulary. Yes, so this is letter D. You can see on the paper okay i still have more okay kids now take a look here do you know what we can see yes this is dark start with letter j so we need to find letter j our vocabulary book and you can stick and then ah yes so this is match okay maybe one more I want to use this picture Yes, so we already have 
knife and cattle here. Yeah, that's good kid. You can find the picture as many as you can at home and try to find the picture from magazine or old oh, newspaper. So happy to try at home kids. Well kids, that's all for today. We did a lot of activities today. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you do all the activities today. And for the parents, please keep give your kids the spirit to watch and do our activities to watch our video and do all the activities from our online class and so thank you so much for watching and see you on the next, next video. video and for parents don't forget to like this video and subscribe in our youtube channel yes and thank you again mm -hmm. for watching uh, keep healthy, keep, keep happy, happy, and bye bye! bye.